Hey guys, Joe here. A little bit different of a video. Uh, sorry if the audio sounds like crap. It's uh, Everything's off my laptop down the shore. So um, there's a program that I use quite a bit. It's called Insightful. Um, what it does is you can put this on um, people's computers and then um, basically you can use it for uh, them to clock in and clock out. And then also you can see once they clock in, what's exactly happening. So the way this works is um, if they are um, if they're not using your company computer, so if you have VAs or, you know, stuff like that, um, then they basically, uh, you send them this link and then what happens is whenever they clock in, um, it's going to track their activities. Now, if it is your own computer, then basically you can have it track all the time without them clocking in or out or anything like that. Um, the cool part is um, here you can see a dashboard that's pretty quick and easy to use um, as far as like what the work time is, um, if they manually add any hours in there. And then here's where it really helps out. So if you're using VA stuff like that, where you're going to charge per hour, stuff like that, what you'll see here is like they clocked in for about 26 and a half hours. They were only on the computer for 18 and a half, right? Um, and then idle time. So it's, uh, you can set it up with, if you want to set it like after two minutes, five minutes, whatever, after two minutes or five minutes of inactivity, um, you know, until they start working again, it's going to show up as idle time. So for this person, you know, he was clocked in for 26, but he really only put in 18 hours worth of effort, right? So why are you inactive for eight hours? Did you not have anything else to do? Um, reason why I'm showing you this is because I have this person um, that was my, um, that's a, a person that's working on uh, one of the projects for me. They clocked in for 40 hours. They were only on the computer for 24, um, uh, less than 25 hours, and they were inactive for 15 hours. So they're trying to charge me $20 an hour. So they're basically trying to charge me an extra $300. And without this, I wouldn't have known, right? And you're probably asking, well, even if, so what happens if they just like move the mouse around and stuff like that? Okay. So what you can do is you go in here scroll down and like you can pick any day that you want and here's where it's like um in this bluish i'm, I'm kind of colorblind so whatever the cell blue is that's when they were actually active and then you'll see here the uh, straight line so they were active for five hours they were inactive for three right and it gets really late in here so they were active for three you know about three and uh three hours, 45 minutes, and they were inactive for three hours and 50 minutes. So they were inactive more than they were actually active, right? And then what you can actually do is go down here and you can see all your screenshots. You can set up your screenshots. I forget the settings. Um, um, ba -ba -ba, tracking, I think it's in here. Oh, okay, here you go. So screenshots, I have it set up for 30 per hour. So basically every, um, you know, two minutes or so, uh, they are um, doing a screenshot. Um, that's the max you can do. Um, and then um, break times you can put in that. Oh, the idle time, like I said, you can change that. Um, they have all that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, that's what we got. Um, but just hopefully this can help you out. Uh, I'm trying to think what else. Oh, it also will do, you can set up, I forget how to do it. It's been a little while, right? So in here, what you see is productive time, right? So you can set up things that are unproductive um, here, right? So like, um, let me see if it shows this unproductive time. I forget how to look it up. I'll have to look that up. Um, but you can set up if things certain, like our kitchen sink system, this is productive, right? Slack, I should actually change this. Um, I have to see where it is. Anyway, um, but this is what we per currently do. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. I haven't honestly got into absolutely everything, so there's probably more that I can do. Um,
Yeah, I forget how to change the things. It's been a little while. But anyway, um, you can set for each one. So if it's like Loom or DocuSign or stuff like that, you can set that up as productive. Or if it's like Facebook, stuff like that, Discord, uh, things that we're not using, um, then at that point, then you can set that as unproductive. Um, so then it's at that point, you'll just have a very clear snapshot, um, you know, snapshot of, you know, what these people were doing. Right. So anyway, hope this helps. Um, have a great time.